Welcome back to Raven Creek, or rather to uh, Lord Wilson's Manor outside Raven Creek. Now, I was going to go check out those doors, but before we do, I have an unlabeled key, which possibly could be the Captain of the Guard's key. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Shed some light on what he's got going on in his office here. Fifty-eight broadhead arrows. That's a lot of arrows. At long last, I have my own office in Lord Wilson's townhouse. I was forever sitting in the office with the other guard. His lordship takes all that paperwork far too seriously. Is it really necessary to write, write a report in triplicate about every squirrel that dares to run across the lawn? I reckon he actually wants us to kill these puny rodents, but they're not a threat, and killing them would be thoroughly demeaning. The maids would scream with laughter if they saw me chasing after them with my sword out. How could I ever hope to get those girls to take me seriously after that? Lord Wilson is also narked by the ravens. He should have known how common those birds are around here. It's not called Raven's Creek for nothing. Nonetheless, his raven shoot is currently on. My archers are well on the way to making fools of themselves and me. In one week, they've killed a measly four ravens and just about wasted our entire supply of arrows. I'm no archer, but even I managed to kill seven of them, and I've still got arrows left. Seems like none of the guys will get promotion and I'll win the bonus. In spite of everything, I'm pretty glad we're living in the countryside without the mother-in-law, Eugenia. That woman not only drove Lord Wilson to destruction on a regular basis, she harassed me often enough. Me, the captain of his lordship's guard, had to walk her fifi three times a day. And walking wasn't the worst of it. That little mud had to be carried across the street. If only it had been a real dog and not a rat dog with a bow and a coat. The beast was so humiliating, maids all over town giggled when they saw us coming. It was mortifying. Lucky for me, that's all over now. All the fault of that so-called master thief, Garrett. If it weren't for him, I'd still be in Lady Gertrude Ashton's service. And that was a fantastic job. But no, this Garrett shows up while the wedding of Lady A's only granddaughter was going on and takes everything that wasn't nailed down. As kind as Lady Gertrude was, she couldn't forgive me for not catching this Garrett and gave me the heave-ho. I was lucky to get another job after that, or I might have ended up at the City Watch. If I ever lay my hands on this Garrett, I'll write a long report about his painful end in triplicate. Oscar Denton, Captain of the Guard. I see, so we have history. That uh, must be a mission I haven't played um, from the Lord Ashton series, I guess. Oh, he's got a nice steak. You know what? Let's turn the lights off in here. Where's the light switch again? Let's on while we're looking for loot. Just, uh, you know, as a courtesy to the viewer. Yeah, it should be visible enough anyway. But... More money, another speed potion. That's two speed potions. Oh, valuable knife. Hmm, whose skull is this? Oh, there's an apple. Put the skull where the apple was and make him wonder. Can I get it lined up nicely? It's not really a game about uh, precise positioning of objects. There we go. Nice uh, spiky weapon on a stick. Right, and take the same door again. Uh, same key again. However, there's the armory upstairs that I can get into, right? Which door was it then? That one? Probably that one. Let's see if this key of uh, the captains will also open that one. making any racket here. Wow, they've got a lot of weapons. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Okay. If I need to cross any marble floors, I'll put out any... Oh, wow. Seven flash bombs. How many water arrows is that now? 20 water arrows. 10 more arrows. Okay. Very generous supply of equipment here. 61 broadheads now. <laughs> that barely makes a difference. 
It's still no repair, so I can't check it up on there, but it's, uh, I suppose that matters. Might as well lock it behind us, right, so nobody suspects a thing. I really should turn that uh, camera fix thing off with to avoid little wobbles. There's an extra jerky head motion there because of the uh, camera was avoiding the cells. Okay. up again and well I mean I maybe dropped the key in the plant pot. Uh, there was another door that I left marked that I didn't have a key for. Actually I should check. I mean maybe Lord Wilson's keys should be a master key, right? It should open any door in the house one might think. No. Probably worth just ch double checking this key doesn't doesn't do that. Just by having to run back for it. I suppose it should, sure. there's no particular reason to suspect it should, but I didn't even notice it's got a horse head on it. No, okay. You know what, actually let's drop it in the fountain here. There we go, now I can see it easily, and uh, everyone else will be surprised to discover it there. Leaning against the door, I can't hear anybody nearby. Let's try the museum key here, shall we? Scrolling through a billion keys. Oh, here's a, there are guards. Several of them. Is that you? See anything? Nothing now. Tricky to get through here undetected. It would be tricky, but what choice do I have? He's not coming here. Oh, the hot dog. Why hot dogs now? Jorken, why on earth is the museum lights still not working properly? The guards tell me that only the ceiling lamps can be turned off. The light switches for the paintings and the artifacts don't work. This is totally unacceptable. I won't tolerate these lamps being on day and night. You are to fix this immediately. Next week, Fritz Benelli and the mechanists will be here to install a new alarm system. By then, the lights must be working. Anything less will cause me huge embarrassment and would certainly lead to your immediate dismissal. Lord Wilson. P.S. Stop eating when you're in the museum. These paintings and artifacts are beyond price. I can't bear the thought of anything being ruined by spillage. Eating and drinking in the museum is strictly forbidden. Oh, these are all the light switches. Okay. <laughs> so... Wait, which way is off and which way is on? Quick, quick, 
buddy. Better be tapping around down here. So I can't nobody is tapping around down here. Alright, that's that door. So the museum key didn't work for this door? Despite being all part of the museum. Okay. That's uh First time I've used an invisibility potion to get out of an impossible spot rather than uh... Uh -huh. Museum back door key, I see. out maybe I don't need to I'm clear but you probably won't notice me here probably Don't know which way these lights go, so let's switch them all that way. Which is normally the off position, I think. Oh, the lower ones aren't working. I guess that's the, what the thing is, what the letter is complaining about. Oh, they turned the light off in here too. That's excellent. That's brilliant. Okay. The duck. So some of this stuff should be valuable too, right? <clears throat> oh, two ducks. <laughs> you know what I would do? If I had those uh, Matryoshka dolls in a mission, exactly what I would do. I don't think I've seen anyone do it. Uh, gotta stay on my toes anyway. Okay. Should now be darker in here. Oh. Slightly, I suppose. means there are patches of darkness. Hmm. So, how do I know what's valuable here to steal and what isn't? So I thought he would turn before he reached me, but just to be sure. Even animated, that's very cool. I like that. It's a nice detail. See me through the damn curtains again. Well, I would seal that, but I don't think I've earned it. Oh ho! What is this? Oh, it's, it's actual, actual dragon loot on display. That's funny. Well,
I guess it's time to go upstairs. Go downstairs, okay. Oh, the goblins also got treasure. Oh, oh, that was. I just glanced. Wait a minute, I've been here, haven't I? Huh. Okay. I just glanced at the, the captions and just. Uh, and I leave that one for no particular reason. And, uh, it happened to be <laughs> a secret lever. I mean, because I was thinking, like, how can none of these have descriptions? It'd be nice if they did. Okay, I don't remember anything on the balcony. Those guards are in a good location for me. Okay, I mean, that's all very well. We need to lock up after ourselves. But... Hey, squirrel. Where's the vault? Where is Lord Wilson's treasure vault? Oh, in the garden. So there any doors here I haven't been to? Is, did I go in here? I think I did. Yeah, yeah, this is where I went, came in the first time. We've got Lord Wilson's key. So that should help a lot with getting into pretty much any door we would want. Where's the vault? It's somewhere in the f accessible from the front room that I haven't been. I mean, why would they want... Oh, we knocked out the guy that walked around here, so there's the two guards. But nobody else to worry about. Okay, we've been here. I've been here. That's just luggage. Right, that's this door open to indicate that I've been here. I mean, this is going to take us back around, which is where I came from. Um, well, let's go around the grounds again. There is still the one guard. One guard sitting outside the door, right? And maybe that door relates to the vault somehow don't know I haven't seen any information about a vault no references to it whatsoever <laughs> yeah, I've been in those doors okay bathroom out there, which... Okay, the, the guard is here, right? Question is, can I get him away from his post? Let's scout from a distance. I don't 
don't think I've got the space there to sneak up behind him. Look, man, I'm gonna go his flash bomb in. Might be the best option, actually. Got so many flash bombs. Look at dynamite, and probably not the right choice. What's that I see? Okay. I think I've been out. I've been in this door anyway. Just trying to hit the uh, gap in here. Be annoying to have to look up directions to the vault. Nobody, and I have been in here, right? Oh well, back to work. Yeah, okay. So this is the library, really. Now I suppose if the vault was, I mean, Lord Wilson is in here. If the vault was in here, that would not be. Surprising, but it also is does not appear to be the case. Let's wait for him to go or to turn around at least before I run back out into the light. I feel like mm. I'm wonder what that noise is. I feel like I've explored the entire uh, house now. Chapel and the vault is certainly not here, this is the bath. I'm going to say certainly not, but... I can't be 100% certain that there's not a secret door somewhere. Very good roof. It would be weird to have a secret door in here leading to a vault, but not, not impossible. What is weird to, is to have absolutely no suggestion, no hints as to where it is from the level itself, like in readables or whatever. Because, uh,. That just means having to find to find it of, of either by luck or by long, painstaking, tedious effort. So goal should be some amount of helpful guidance and some amount of diligence needed, not not just search everywhere. Oh well. Could have find it and open it and unlock it, right? ground floor. See if there's any way that like, seems suspicious. Oh, there's a clock. I thought it was a valuable plate that I might have missed. Leading onto the garden. Yeah, right. Museum and garden. Let me go back up to Lord Wilson's 
bedroom then maybe we can find something there. It's about the only idea I have at the moment. Unless... Oh, that's the bar there. What's this door on the right? Where does this lead? Oh! I was like, what's that on the floor? That's a stake. That's the stake I dropped because I didn't have the key to this place. I've got Lord Wilson's key now. This must be his vault. Looks important. What's his office? I should be careful in here. There are likely a few traps around. I should be careful in here. There are likely a few traps around. <laughs> That is brilliant. Ah, oh, you, you sneaky bird, you. Wasn't expecting that. Wasn't expecting that. Ah, what, what? <laughs> this is some, this is awesome. Ah. Uh... How was that? <laughs> what the hell is that? Uh, okay, that was not what I was expecting. Wasn't expecting that. Wasn't expecting that. Ah, what? Ah! So probably that set off a big fire arrow trap. Hmm. What about that? <laughs> What a weird contraption. Let's see what these controls do. What a weird contraption. Let's see what these controls do. Ah! <laughs> uh, I, I'm still amused by that. Okay, I can't do anything with those controls. But the light's gone on. Does that mean that the traps are disarmed? No. Can I stop this thing in midair? Apparently not. Can I just stay out of its way? Ah. Oh, I see. <laughs> okay. I might need to do that. Anyway. Don't touch her. Don't touch her. Well, that's weird that it gets set off by that. Don't touch her. Okay, I won't touch her. What? Okay, I don't understand what's going on. The move to my new estate went as planned. However, my oh-so-capable workers turned out to be absolutely incompetent in technical matters. There's practically no security for my gold in the vault. I'm flabbergasted. 
I built myself a large vault, order an extra strong vault door, and now it turns out that I can't even lock the door. That's just not on. I had to post guards everywhere to beef up security as the wall alone won't keep the thieves out. Thankfully, Lady Lottie told me about the work of the mechanists at Lord Joseph Smeller and offered to contact Ben Spinelli. In about two weeks, the mechanists will be here to turn my property into a fortress. Until then, I'll keep the guards on sentry duty round the clock, even though I don't trust a single one of them. If they knew the safe was unlocked, they'd rob me without batting an eyelid. Luckily, their intelligence is very limited. I only hope that my caretaker Jochen can sort out the problem with the light in the museum. It would be really embarrassing if the mechanists arrived here and friend Spinelli had to deal with such a piffling matter. For the time being, I will enjoy the opening ceremony and mingle with the guests. Hopefully Lady Lottie isn't already drunk, but then her manners always leave a lot to be desired. After that, I'll go to the library and get something to read. Dear Lord Wilson, our mutual friend Lady Lottie told me of your wish to secure your estate, and especially the vault and museum, with a modern alarm system which is proof against thieves. Of course, I am willing to help you with this. As you will know, I was in the service of Lord Joseph for many years, and Lady Lottie has warmly recommended you to me. I have already made preparations and will explain my plans to you in great detail on my arrival. Once my work is finished, no thief, no matter how artful, will be able to steal even the tiniest sliver of gold from your manor. I and my colleagues will make our way to your estate near Ravens Creek immediately. You can expect our arrival in about two weeks. Most respectfully, your friend Spinelli. Okay. I assume that's good. <laughs> Guess that means the portal lighting's done. Anything else here to throb? Maybe I'm just playing with the office chair, right? Maybe it doesn't actually mean anything. What was the point of this? It doesn't seem to do anything. Unless there's something I picked up. I mean, is the Rubik's Cube just a joke? Or is it part of a mechanism? I feel like I just there's just things here without that I'm supposed to figure out the trial and error, which I'm not so keen on. Okay, if the the mechanism I frobbed is not something I picked up, apparently. It's not, it didn't go in my inventory. So, uh... Unless it went into my weapons, which would be very weird, but... I guess I could just check that. Nope. Oh. Uh -huh. I can prop the bird again and get the trap set off, and maybe that's what I need to do. Can I just do it from here? I mean, I know the switch is there, which is kind of cheating. This doesn't seem right to me, but I don't know what would be right. Still set off all the traps. Oh. Oh, what the hell? Was that always there? Actually, let's check that. That's sitting down here somewhere. No. Where did that come from? <gasps> ah! well, that, that killed me regardless of whether things hit me. Um. Huh. Well, I guess we do this then, and and just. Read the paper then, as it comes, because I don't know where it comes from, but it does come out. Nothing else seems to break, so it doesn't feel like the right solution. Oh. 
No, the paper's not there now. Okay, let's reload. Maybe the paper's actually hidden somewhere else in the room and got blown over there by the fire arrows. Hiding among one of the bookshelves. Under here. Or under his desk, maybe. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Right, so we have the Rubik's Cube, the chair, this chair, which I've probed both to spin. Okay, we've probed the cage to spin as well. We got that. This. <sighs> ah. I should be able to find something in here. I should be able to find something in here. Ah! Why doesn't that do anything? Hmm, this indicates on top. <laughs> ah. Okay, it is on top. And then... There's one by the basket here. Was it a telephone? Waste paper basket isn't there. What does the picture show? Yeah, it must be the telephone. Okay, this painting has one, right? Does it? I don't see one. And I'm going to do that again in case it's relevant. It's the only way I know of to expose the switches by the paintings, right? Hey. Or the switch by the painting. This is just what I was looking for. Now I've got a real plan. Ah, I'm looking for. What? I at last been out Oh, oh, finale. Oh, oh. Didn't understand the word of that. Where's my Rubik's Cube? Seems like it fit nice in here, no? Hmm. It does fit nicely in there, but it doesn't seem to be the thing I need to do with that. I don't know. I guess I got all the things. Oh, the uh, piece of paper got blown away somewhere. There it is. Yeah, I guess I got all the switches. Well, I didn't think I got that one. There's like two things marked there, right? One of them's that. But I didn't... I don't think I dropped a switch. But, well, we found the... Now, on to the vault. You're not going to repeat that one? You've had your fun? Okay. My hunting trophies. What the fuck? What the fuck? So fuck. What the? What the fuck? I'm sorry, I don't really have any words to say other than that. Two guards on super high speed for some reason. 
I don't understand what was that in because I probed the wolf or was it just because I went into that room? I don't understand. Let's eat some food. I guess one of those hit points back. I think I have a healing potion somewhere as well, but I might as well just simplify my inventory at the same time, right? Got all these cakes. There we go. Oh, it actually takes damage. Once. Wait, could I have just probed that all along? Yeah, what a mess. Pick it up. Save no DNA. Lupus II, my very first riding horse, a loyal companion on many hunting trip. Alas, the wolf was much faster. <laughs> Give me up! Oh, that's... Where did that come from? Player? Oh. The vault door doesn't that doesn't count as being open. Oh. Is that an alarm I can hear? Don't know. Uh right, so the vault is a problem, right? It doesn't count as being open yet. So this is where we need the dynamite, and that's why we've got the flare, I guess. Okay, it's there, and I... Oh, I light the fuse and run, I see. Okay, yeah, I should probably run further than that, shouldn't I? Let me get all the way up. Where's, where's my, where's my flare? So maybe why I just should have had a speed potion ready. What? Whatever happens, do not kill anybody. Can I kill somebody? Alright, well let's try this again with the speed potion at the ready. How do I kill somebody? Should I be putting the dynamite on the inside? I don't understand what's happening here. I don't understand who's counting as dying. Maybe I'm supposed to put, put it in here somehow? It won't let me. Yeah, it won't let me put it in there.
Am I supposed to blow it up um, with it closed? I can try it. I don't really understand what's happening. Oh, it's probably killing those people there. Those guards. I see the guards that are knocked out and put down there. They're probably close enough to the explosion to get to get kills. So let's go. Let's go move them. Oh, these these guards are certainly close enough. The ones out here are probably fine. These two guards are dying. I expect that's all that it was. Okay, I was gonna go look. Oh, hang on. More evidence. Oh, that's that's the. The strangely undead raven's blood. Still probably better cleaned up. You know what, let's make sure they're... No, they'll be fine. I was not hurt at this distance, so that'll be fine. Okay, now I've got the door open anyway, so I can just light the thing and run out without needing my speed potion, I guess. Where is it? Well, I guess we don't have another use for speed potions, so, uh... Sure, let's, uh... Okay, do I, do I not... Right. That's successful. Succeeded that time. Objective complete. The safe door is open. Oh yes, it's kind of fell down. Why do we need Leon and his men? Okay, maybe they need to carry off most of the gold bars. Yeah, there's a lot. There's a lot more here than I can carry. But there is a lot that I can that I can do. You know, make sure I get my share sorted out. I've done all the hard work after all. I guess maybe I use the flare to signal Leon and his friends. Not sure yet. Yeah. Find out. And I guess the loot gold was gonna be a problem. <laughs> Because we're well over it now. Even the expert loot goal was only 9,000. I did check it. And now we are over 9,000. As one might say. <sighs> Alright. Hope you're happy, Raven. Need to go upstairs. Walk a little quieter here because there's still people alive in there. Oh, I don't have the flare anymore. Okay, so that's not going to be part of the signal. How do I get upstairs? Where's the front room? Don't know where the two guards are. Oh, there's the posh guy that walks around like he didn't see me. All right, well, let's go signal. <gasps> hey guys, <laughs> woohoo to woo. <sighs> All right, uh, well, I still somehow missed two and a half thousand loot. Sorry, 2,200 and one. <laughs> Uh, so there's two more secrets hiding somewhere as well. But honestly, 12,000 is, is nothing to sneeze at. I should keep going for at least three more days. So, uh, we robbed Lord Wilson. And, well, I mean, our share of the actual gold bars should come to quite a lot as well. 
so I think we, uh, I think we can say we won. That was Raven Creek. Wonder what happens next. I don't know if there is a next. Certainly there's, there's earlier missions that Christine made in campaigns that uh, this one re refers to that I, that I should check out. But that will be sometime in the future. So thanks very much for watching. And I hope you'll join me here for the next mission. Whatever it turns out to be.